Hey there everyone and welcome back to another Vlogmas episode. Today is Vlogmas Day 9 I believe and today is just going to be about fashion. Um, for you guys that just follow me for the fashion I have some fashion content for you today. So um, I'm going to be styling up my thrifted pieces that I recently um, showed you guys in a thrift haul I believe. I think it was about a month ago at this point. So yeah so I'm just going to share with you guys um, how I style up my thrifted pieces because I don't think I even tried on yeah, I, def I definitely didn't try on those thrifty pieces that I showed you guys in um, a previous vlog. So today I'm going to do that. I'm not gonna, only going to try them on, but <laughs> I'm going to share with you guys how to style them or style up the pieces. And so a lot of these pieces are like trendy. I'm just looking at them now here on my floor. <laughs> um, but a lot of these pieces are trendy items or for like, you know, the winter, like the fall and winter. Although we are about to approach the uh, winter season in a couple of weeks or I think next week. Um, but anywho, so yeah, a lot of these pieces incorporate a lot of um, fall and winter fashion trends. So um, just to show you that you can thrift these trends. You don't have to go out to, you know, um, the retailers and get the stuff brand new. You can go to the thrift store and thrift a lot of these trendy pieces. So if you're into trendy pieces, you know trendy fashion and you don't want to break the bank then girl go to the thrift store i mean go to the thrift store anyway because it's just more economical especially if you're not one to go out and buy stuff all the time or um on the contrary if you do like to buy stuff a lot if you like to shop then a thrift store is just one way to kind of save some coin and you get you know unique pieces and you know yeah that's why i like to thrift i like to go find you know unique pieces like when i'm in the mood for like you know something unique then i like to go to the thrift store so um but yeah you guys also let me know what you think about this makeup look like i definitely did like a glam makeup look today with like a cranberry eye color so if you guys want a little makeup tutorial on that let me know in the comments i'm just i'm interested to know it took me a minute to do this so um if you guys want to see how i did this then let me know in the comments but anyway so without any further rambling from me let me share with you guys these outfits all right, so we're just gonna get in, do it in front of the mirror and just kind of do this real casual like um so let me do a recap of the thrifted pieces so the first thrifted item is going to be this blazer it's in this pinstripe i don't know if you're able to see it but it's like a very small kind of pinstripe and then also the belt this gold belt is also um was from that thrift haul and it is super stretchy and i absolutely love it it's a good um piece to like cinch in your waist which is what i've done here so this is one of the thrifted pieces that um i got recently and then the last thrifted pieces is this skirt and excuse me if it's a little wrinkled job but um but yeah so this is another pinstriped item as well so pinstripes um since we're talking about trends is one of um the season's hottest trends as well as suiting because this is like a suit type of situation so the um, trends in this outfit is going to be uh, pinstripes and suiting so um, and the pinstripes don't match but like because the blazer the pinstripes and the blazer are a little bit smaller than the pinstripes or they're more closer together I should say they're not any bigger but they're just the pinstripes are closer to get closer together in the blazer and they're more spread apart in the skirt I hope you guys can see that but but they're both black so it still works so um, but yeah, so the rest of the pieces I have on this blue, like pussy bow blouse. I've had this for years. I don't even know where I got it from, but I thought this outfit would be cute styling up like blue and black or navy blue and black. I know some people kind of feel some type of way about styling up black and navy blue together, but I just think that's a good color combination. I love it. So, um, I just thought I would have like a pop of color if you will with this blue um blouse like i said it has a little pussy bow just to add a little detail to the neckline um and then as far as my handbag i just have this little kind of like clutch little bag you can't really do anything but put it in the crook of your arm or kind of hold it like a top top handle um, but this is from zara and then as far as on my feet i have on these boots um, I think these are from ASOS, but these are old too. I've had these for a while. And then I just have on some sheer tights underneath the skirt. So, but this is the outfit um, that I put together with these three of my thrifted pieces. And I absolutely love it. It's, you know, suiting, playing off suiting and, you know, pinstripes, like I said. And I love this outfit. I would wear this to church because um, I don't think the slit is too high. Um, I think it's just modest enough, but I have on... Um, 
you know, pantyhose or stockings. So um, I think that kind of helps a little bit. But yeah, I think this is a cute outfit to wear to date night. Um, although it's kind of a little too dressy for date night. But um, as far as for the season, I think this is something cute to wear um, for like a Christmas party. I think, yeah, you could wear a suit to a Christmas party. I mean, you know, especially if it's like an office Christmas party. Um, I think this will be a cute outfit. So, but yeah, go get you a oversized blazer because I got this blazer from the men's section um, at uh, my local thrift store. As a matter of fact, I got it from the Goodwill. So all these thrifted pieces I got from the Goodwill. So, but yeah, love this outfit. You guys let me know what you think. Um, I know the boots is kind of like not everybody's thing, but um, for me, it's more realistic because I'm not really a heels girl. Although I probably could, would, you know, put on some heels or maybe even some um, knee high boots you can also yeah substitute the little booties because these are kind of like a booty like a tall booty you can um, swap them out for some knee high boots or some heels so but yeah love this outfit you guys let me know what you think about how I put my three thrifted pieces together with this look and we will get into the next look all right here is the next outfit and um, this is just like I don't know like a casual outfit yeah I would call this a casual outfit um, with just a little bit of razzle dazzle so the thrifted pieces that I styled up is this skirt and um, in case you haven't seen that video where I actually did thrift haul I will um, put it up here for you guys to see like some of the pieces up close um, just because I'm not gonna really show these pieces up close because I've already um, featured them in another video so um, if you want to see yeah, like I said, see them featured then just watch that uh, previous vlog. But um, and I have a lot of skirts. So just a fair warning. Um, this is a video for you if you love skirts. If you don't love skirts, this isn't the video for you because um, I think I went into the thrift store wanting to um, find some like mini skirts. Girl, I don't know why I thought I was going to find mini skirts or why I'm even trying to find mini skirts because I'm not really a huge fan of them. Um, but I ended up finding a whole bunch of other type of skirts like maxi skirts and midi skirts. I found a whole bunch of those. So, um, and this is one of them. So yeah, I love this skirt. I love the plaid detail, which we know plaid is another huge trend for the uh, fall and winter season. Plaid is a trend, but it's still a classic. I feel like it, cause it comes back around year after year. It's just the pattern of the season, uh, plaid. Um, so yeah, I love this one because it has like brown and black in it and I just love brown and black together. So I knew I had to get this skirt. Plus it has some fringe detail at the bottom. I don't know if you can see, it's just enough fringe. It's not too much. And then it has um, a little slit on the side. Yeah, it's just on that one side. Um, the split and it's not too high up so love this skirt like I said it screams fall winter season so I just um, added a few details to bring out the colors in the skirt so starting from the top I just wanted to have a little bit of fun with this outfit so I added on this gold beret like gold sequin beret that I got from Zara I actually have this in black too and yeah just to kind of go with the the scheme the color scheme of this outfit because the gold kind of kind of goes with the outfit because I do have gold so um yeah I just wanted to add a little fun and add this beret although it's kind of the way I have it styled up it's kind of styled up like a little beanie um that's because I have my hair in a bun and I didn't feel like maneuvering my hair to get this thing to work but yeah I think it looks cute like this um and then I just have on a vest this vest is from Amazon I have this I think in another color yeah I have it in a brown color like a chocolate brown color um underneath it I just have on a layering top a layering um turtleneck that I got from H&M I wanted to add a little pop of color because this is very neutral so we know red is the color of the season so I went with my red coach um what is this the coach uh pillow tabby bag um yeah love it so just add a little pop of color and then I kept on the same boots from the last outfit just because I love these boots and really the skirt kind of covers the shoes so I could have wore any type of footwear and really it's the skirt is pretty much going to cover it so yeah I just kept on these same boots um because this is how I would wear this um skirt or this is how I would wear the outfit with some boots so but I love this outfit like I said it's a cute casual going out type of an outfit um it's also a cute outfit to wear um for like an office Christmas party I mean we have sequins so that's your little razzle dazzle um and you know it's kind of it actually kind of looks like a little kind of like um what do you call it like a cabin chic or like a 
uh, get away to like a lodge somewhere like an Aspen or something that's kind of like what this outfit kind of gives me or the vibes it gives me it's kind of like you know uh, going to Aspen like a cute outfit to wear in Aspen although you probably would freeze to death because you definitely would need more layers but you can always add more layers depending on where you live like I could put on a coat because I probably wouldn't just go out like this especially if it's like really cold I layer on and put another like thick coat on top of this um, I have a black coat that I'm waiting on for mango that I would just put on top of this um, and yeah you can always wear um, instead of I have um, some uh, leg uh, not leggings or you could put leggings on with this um, if you need a little bit more warmth I just have on some pantyhose or some stockings some sheer tights so but of course depending on how cold it is you can wear some like thermal leggings or something to keep you more warm but it's definitely an, like an aspen outfit so um, but yeah, so that is this outfit. You guys let me know what you think about it and we will get into the next one. All right, and this next outfit is very Christmassy, very festive. Um, I really love this outfit. So the thrifted pieces that I'm working with, um, is this belt and we know these belts, or if you don't know these kind of belts, but like stud details and just like embellished belts are just huge right now like belts with like buckles and all the things um are huge right now so i found this at the thrift store and just absolutely love it it's just definitely giving me like western vibes but it just has like little um diamantes just all around it and just so pretty i don't have any i don't think i have a black belt yeah i definitely don't have any black belts like this um i have a brown one but i don't have a black one so love it and it's kind of long or yeah it's kind of long for me so I just did like a little hack by putting like a little elastic um yeah like a little elastic around it just to kind of keep it secure so it's not flapping so that's just kind of like a little hack you guys can use if you have belts that are big or if you buy a belt uh, from the thrift store and it's too big you can use an elastic um, to keep it in place and then um, if you need more holes put into it you can always get like a little belt hole puncher which uh, there's one that I got off of Amazon that I absolutely love. I'll link it down below if you guys are looking for like a hole puncher for like a belt. Um, but anywho, so back to the thrifted pieces. So yeah, this belt is thrifted and then this skirt. Um, you guys, I remember I told you I was going and looking for like a some mini, mini skirts that I can style up just like this. So I found this at the thrift store. By the way, these skirts, I haven't even mentioned the prices because of these things I've already taking the price tag off and everything so the skirts were like five dollars i believe this belt um i think this belt was like maybe two dollars um so everything was little i think everything was less than like ten dollars so you know you can't beat that at the, at the thrift store girl um but yeah so this skirt was five dollars and i love the plaid detail again plaid is a huge trend right now and this has red and gray in it so another like I guess micro trend would be like red and gray together um so I love that color combination so um yeah I love this skirt I immediately got it when I found it so um but yeah I love the the red and the gray in this particular plaid so with that kind of helped me come up with the outfit for this um so yeah starting from the top um I accessorized with silver and gold just because we're dealing with the color combination of gray or not silver and golds <laughs> silver <laughs> um what am I saying? I um, accessorized with silver uh, because we have a lot of silver going on with the outfit with silver and or gray and red. So starting from the top, I just added on a little necklace, a little silver necklace. Um, I think I got this from Shein. And then this top, this um, I just recently got this top, this turtleneck, red turtleneck from uh, Zara. It does have buttons on it, like little buttons on the cuff that are gold, but you know you can't see it because I'll probably end up wearing the uh, trench coat you know over my arm so you won't be able to see that so um yeah so this is new from zara i just recently got this and showed this in a recent zara haul and then this handbag it's like a silver metallic handbag from zara that's old um i um trench coat this is from shein and it doesn't even look like it came from shein it looks like really good quality but i got this from shein last year or the year before last i want to say might have been last year um, I was looking for a gray trench coat and found this. So love it to go with the gray and the red. And then I have on the same tights. And then I have on these boots that I just recently got from Steve Madden. But I got them off of Macy's. And they're like in this gray kind of like distressed gray if you will. I don't know if you can tell on camera. But they're like a distressed type of gray. So love these. I love the buckles on them just to kind of go with the detail in the belt. So 
but yeah i love this outfit just a festive outfit a festive look um to wear um like you know this would be a cute outfit to wear christmas day if you're like going somewhere to somebody's house or something it'll be cute to wear to like a christmas party like like an office christmas party just any kind of christmas party going out with your friends with your girlfriends whoever your husband or something so um yeah absolutely love this outfit you guys let me know what you think about it maybe we'll get into the next one all right here's the next outfit and this is probably out of all of them i loved all i've loved all of them to be honest with you but this one is probably my favorite because it's just so classy chic and sophisticated so the um thrifty piece that i'm styling up is this skirt so this skirt is like a brownish yeah, it's like a brown color um yeah i guess it depends on what you're wearing as far as how it looks but it's definitely um brown and i love like this little detail here with like these little um circle detail here kind of like a belt but not really so love that and again this one is five dollars from the thrift store so um as far as the rest of the pieces um i have on as far as top i have on this burgundy top that i just recently got from h m and it is a cake dupe and i absolutely love it because of the neckline it's kind of like a square neckline with like a uh, sweetheart neckline kind of a square and a sweetheart neckline so I love it because I love this part of my body I know some people don't but I just love my decolletage or decolletage however you want to say it I just love this part of my body so um yeah I love this um top I got it in a medium I think it's still available on H&M um but yeah I did get this from H&M and I love the burgundy color of it I've been loving burgundy here lately I've been um, buying up a lot of burgundy stuff as well as red stuff because red is my favorite color too so um but yeah so that is the top and then um draped over my shoulders i have on a like a plaid or checkered print coat that i got from asos this is probably one of my favorite coats that i've owned or that i own i've had had this for years and it has burgundy and brown it has a little bit of green so it has several colors in it that i can just wear to bring out those colors so i love this coat it's very like european um and as far as my handbag this is my teddy blake handbag that i just recently got from the brand um this was gifted to me but i absolutely love it i told, told you guys in a previous vlog that i manifested this bag because i've been looking for a burgundy handbag and just haven't been able to find one and teddy blake reached out and gifted me this so manifestation is real y'all so yeah just to go with the burgundy and then of course the skirt and then the boots i went with like these camel or like a cognac color boot that i got from h&m a few years ago and they are actually a knee-high boot um but i wore them for um the color because i love the color of them just i was thinking about wearing um chocolate brown just to go with the brown in this outfit or i also have some burgundy boots but i thought let me just add another color just to go um bring out some more color um just to make it not so matchy matchy so that's why i went with these cognac boots instead of like burgundy or like chocolate brown so but absolutely love this outfit like i said this is definitely one of my favorites this is definitely like a winter office look if like you work in an office setting and you know you want to you know uh, wear something you know nice and cute to the office then this is a cute uh, outfit so burgundy and brown you just i love that color combination burgundy i feel like can go with a lot of things so um but the star of the show obviously is the skirt so love this skirt and one of the trends um another trend besides burgundy that's huge right now of course brown is huge and then um like these but they call them circle skirts but it's basically just an a-line skirt so i've been seeing a lot um of those type of skirts um online and just talked about so yeah it's like an a-line skirt i don't know if you can see so it's not like a straight skirt it's just basically a lines out so and i love it has like these little pleating details on it yeah i absolutely love this skirt i'll have this skirt forever so and it's really good quality so um but yeah so that is this outfit the next outfit you guys let me know what you think about this one this is very regal this is definitely very European. I see a lot of European um, like influencers and fashion girlies wearing outfits like this. So, love it. So, you guys let me know what you think about it. And we'll get into the next one. Alright, and here is the next outfit. And I um, definitely love this. This is definitely giving me like academia vibes. Like, not really dark. Well, I guess, yeah. Dark academia vibes. Um, so, let me take off the um blazer because it is not a thrifted piece so i want to talk about the thrifted pieces real quick so um as far as the thrifted pieces 
Um, the first thrifted pieces is going to, or thrifted piece is going to be this vest, and we know vests are huge and trendy right now, as well as um, another the the color of this vest, which is like a butter yellow color. That is another huge trend for the season. I think this will probably carry over into 2024 as well. Just this butter yellow color and just vest too. So, and this particular vest um, it has like little cable knitted cable knitting like three little cable knit stripes which I think is just um perfect and then I took the um belt that I had on earlier it is also um thrifted from that same from the same thrift um haul um I just took it and cinched in the um vest because this is a men's vest a lot of my pieces I get from the men's section so this is a men's style or a men's vest so um and it was a little big so I just wanted to cinch in the waist just to give me some kind of waist and so and because this is long it just kind of yeah it just kind of works um and the next thrifted pieces is or the next thrifted piece is this skirt and like I said we got a lot of skirts going on in this thrift haul so um, but this skirt it's in this like cream and brown color as you can see so like yeah like cream and brown so um, even though it doesn't have any yellow in it I think the yellow vest just kind of like adds a little bit of pop of color to an off you know otherwise neutral outfit so it just kind of brings a little bit of you know fun detail to the look otherwise it's just all brown which is not which is fine you know it's not bad it's just sometimes you just want a little bit of brightness to kind of brighten the outfit up so it's not too just so dark so um that's what i did with this vest so love this vest um it has some navy blue like little um piping going around it but you can barely tell it especially when i wear the brown turtleneck which by the way this brown turtleneck i think i got this from um shein um but yeah so because i have on a dark color underneath it you can barely tell because the brown, the dark brown turtleneck just kind of hides the blue um but i definitely could wear this with um like jeans or something but we'll we won't talk about what we all can style these pieces up with um because this will be uh, it's already going to be a long video this will be even longer if i start talking about what we can style the pieces up with um but anywho so yeah so um those are the thrifted pieces um i already talked about the um turtleneck the handbag this is from all saints my new favorite bag that i got over the summer you can still wear these textured bags in the summertime it just adds um, a little bit of interesting detail to the look and then um, I have on some brown tights that I think I got these I got these last year I'm just now wearing them I don't even know where I got them from but yeah I got these brown sheer tights on and then I have on my brown Prada loafers which goes perfectly with this outfit so um but yeah um and then the blazer I'll pop the blazer back on just to kind of you know add a little bit of um hold on y'all all right, so we'll add the blazer back on um, just to add a little bit of warmth um, to the look. Um, just because I haven't set up any blazers, most of, of the outerwear has been coats. So um, I just thought I would wear a blazer with this outfit. Um, just And I love like the contrast of like the camel, like the camel of the blazer and then the, the dark brown. I just love that contrast. So, um, but yeah, I love this outfit. Um, again, a chic outfit, very collegiate, um, very academia type of an outfit. Um, I definitely would wear this. Um, I'd wear this to church probably. Um, I'd wear it. I don't know if I wear it to date night. It's too. I don't know. It's too preppy for date night. I think when I go for date night, I want something more. Uh, I don't know more sexy this isn't really giving off sexy date night with my husband um this is more like teacher going to a conference <laughs> but you know in the best way possible though um I love this type of a um, style and I love this type of dressing um you guys been following me know that I love this so um but you guys let me know what you think about it how I styled up this look with the pe thrifted pieces so um but yeah we'll get into the next look all right and here's the next outfit and we're going full on monochrome with this look so um, I love a monochromatic look I just think it just makes the outfit look more chic makes you look more put together makes you look more effortless so um, the thrifted piece that I'm working with with this one is of course another skirt and this one is like one of those pleated skirts which we know are huge and trendy right now um, again they to me they're classic uh, uh, you know a pleated skirt is classic so I don't see it as a trend but because everybody's talking about them it is a trend right now so um, but 
but I love this. I love the color of it. It just has so much pleating in it. And just actually, this actually looks like um, some, some sort of a dress, actually. But um, it is two, two different pieces. But yeah, so this skirt is my thrifted piece in this whole outfit. So, um, so starting from the top with the rest of the pieces, I just put on a cream beanie to go with the cream in my handbag. Um, just to add a little bit of, I know, additional color if you want to call cream a color um because this is more i would say more of a casual look but it's more of like an elevated casual type of a look um that's why i went with like this little beanie so yeah it's like a rib beanie i don't even know where i got this from i've had it for a while um and then this is a cropped um bomber jacket it's like um like in this felt i don't know if it's felt but it's really soft um, and this is um, something that I just recently got from Zara just recently actually um, I showed this in a recent Zara haul so um, and it's cropped and it's super warm like I wore this one day out I think to a basketball game a girl almost burned up burned up it was so hot but it's really thick so it'll definitely keep you warm so um, and I love like the little pocket detail so um, and then my handbag just like a little canvas little um, tote bag that is also from Zara and then as far as on my boots, I have on these boots. I think these are also from Zara. These are old though. I've had these for a while. Um, but yeah, I think these are a dupe of like the Prada ones. I think Prada sells some boots like this. So, um, but just a monochromatic look, like I said, um, you can't go wrong with just one tone or just one color of an outfit. Like I said, it just makes the outfit look more chic, more sophisticated, uh, more effortless, if you will. And it's just an easy way to get dressed. Like just put two colors or put one color together. If like, if you have red, just, you know, that may be too bold, but you know, it's like all black or all cream and white or all beige or all any other, any color that you have in your wardrobe. If you have multiples in different pieces, then just put it together and create an outfit. It just, yeah, it just makes the outfit look more elevated in my opinion. But, um, yeah, so this is a cute outfit to run errands. Like I said, if I want to look cute and chic, um, I may wear this, uh, me and my daughter are going to go to like the Christmas markets here in Atlanta. So, or one of the Christmas markets. So this might be a vibe. This might be an outfit that I wear to go explore the uh, Christmas markets because I have on my tights and, um, I'll be nice and warm. I have my boots. They aren't, they're heel boot, but they're not too high so I can walk in them and yeah, just the perfect casual elevated casual look so um but yeah you guys let me know what you think about it and we will get into the final outfit all right here is the last outfit and it is definitely my favorite <laughs> um yeah the one that i said was my favorite earlier which i'm just trying to think which one it was i liked all these outfits all these outfits especially working with thrifted pieces um, are just top tier. I love these. Um, so as far as the thrift pieces with this outfit, this whole outfit is basically thrifted for the most part. Um, so we'll start from the top. The one of the thrifted pieces I have is this scarf and it's like in this paisley print, but I don't know if you can tell it has like little specks of red in it just to kind of go with the red theme or some of the red in this outfit. So yeah, I don't know if you can see, but yeah, I love to thrift scarves. I love to thrift scarves at the thrift store. I just think that's just one more, you know, less expensive way to, you know, style up your outfit is with scarves. And basically how I tied this scarf is I kind of went, um, I folded it in a triangle. If you guys want to see how I did it, then just let me know. But I folded it like in a triangle, then rolled it. And then I took the scarf and went like I have to show y'all if y'all want to see how I you know style up this scarf or how I styled this scarf up let me know um because it's hard to really explain it but basically I just went I took it then went around and then wrapped it and just kind of went around came back and then tied it in a knot here on the side um you obviously can do it in the front but I like it on the side because I have it on my necklaces so um but yeah I have these necklaces I've had these for years don't even know where I got them from pearls is a huge trend right now so um, I put on a few of my little pearl necklaces that I've had in my wardrobe for, like I said, years. And then the top, it is thrifted. Um, it is, it has bonjour on it. And I love it. It has like this little graphic detail with like the Eiffel Tower and like this lady. And she has like a red bag, red lips, and a red um, shoes, which I love that. It's so me. Um, but it also has like little rivets on it, like little, um, yeah, like little rivet details on it. I don't know what you call stud detail yeah like little stud details kind of like throughout the graphic part of it and it's like a um, it's like a sweatshirt type of type of material so kind of makes it a little um like dressed down in the sleeves or kind of like cap sleeve 
and or the shoulder I should say it's like a cap uh, sleeve shoulder and it is like a it is pretty short um, I have long arms so it's hard for me to find things that fit so I just kind of rolled it up a little bit to wear it kind of like that three-quarter length and just absolutely love it and then this handbag is also thrifted but I didn't get this in that last thrift haul this is I've had this for probably a year I got this last year I believe at the thrift store so um, and then the skirt to the start of the show I love this tool um, skirt it's a it, it falls again with that trend of like circle skirts or like those a-line skirts and this has like little um, stud details on it as well so it's actually like little um, pearl did not pearls these are like um, what do you call them yeah like stud details pearl pearl-esque um, embellishments on it so just absolutely love it. it's a tool skirt and it just has like um, the fabric underneath it too so um, so love this skirt and then another star of the show are tights I just purchased these red tights from sheer text absolutely love them I know red tights is not for everybody just red in general is not for everybody and definitely red tights is probably not for everybody but I've been seeing them styled up in so many different ways and so I just had to get me a pair so these are from sheer text it took a while to get them too um, the shipping is really it took a really long time to get these um, but I love them and then I have on some red shoes these red shoes are from Zara there's like a block heel and they tie at the ankle um, another trend is like red tights with red shoes I've been seeing that a lot lately and so I just thought I would try it out and see um, this definitely is like a girly um, outfit definitely Parisian um, just very feminine um, which a lot of these outfits are pretty feminine um, but um, every now and again I like to just dress feminine sometimes I like to put a little edginess into the outfits but sometimes it's good to just dress feminine I mean we are women so um, that's just part of being a woman is embracing your femininity so um, and then I have a coat let me put my coat on alright so and here is the coat and it's actually a fur fur faux fur coat try saying that five times fast faux fur coat <laughs> um, and this is old from H&M of all places if you could believe it and it's really good quality it's super thick and it's like in this cream kind of beigey like a beigey gray color if you will like a grayish if you will so absolutely love it it's super thick like I said and oversized so I was gonna go with a red coat because I do have a red coat but I thought that would be too much red like I like the pops of red in this outfit and I feel like if I it would have worked if I really wore my red coat but I feel like this is more I don't know this is more digestible <laughs> if you will like I think wearing a red coat would just be too much red so um but I love this outfit this is a cute outfit to wear for Christmas day um or like a Christmas dinner like if you're going out Christmas Eve you know to dinner Christmas Eve or something um I just love this outfit like I'm definitely going to wear this um at some point um during the holidays I don't know where I'm going to go because I don't have anything planned but um I don't know we I may plan for uh, me and my family to go like out to eat or something to a nice restaurant Christmas Eve if there's something still open Christmas Eve or maybe go during the day Christmas Eve day before everything closes so but yeah I love this outfit it's so cute and just so chic and just yeah it's just everything y'all let me know what you think about it but yeah absolutely love this outfit <laughs> Right, guys so that is all with the outfits you guys let me know which outfit was your absolute favorite I would love to know um, I'm trying to make sure I styled up everything um, I think this outfit the one that I have on now this is definitely my favorite <laughs> um, and then maybe the outfit styling up I'm trying to find it yeah the outfit styling up my brown skirt this skirt right here yeah that probably is the next I mean I liked all of those outfits I like them all um I'm not, I'm not trying not to be biased in it or anything like that but I definitely liked all of the outfits so um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed um just to give you some outfit inspo and also just to kind of encourage you to that you don't have to go out here and buy anything new like I love to shop but let's just be honest let's just keep it real um you can't you know it would you would be broke every day <laughs> like you would never have any money if you went out here and bought you know things every you know um brand new you know the thrift store is more economical um especially if you like i said like me and like to shop um but i like it too because it's you know it's more affordable and also like i said i can find some unique hidden gems that 
not everybody is you know out here wearing so um, but they're still trendy pieces too so um, all these pieces for the most part are yeah kind of trendy for the fall and winter season so um, so obviously I can't link anything <laughs> um, but go to the to the thrift store you'd be shocked at some what you would find that's similar to what I showed you guys um, but anything that I that I did show that is available I will try to link I'm trying to think if I showed anything those Steve Madden boots um, those knee high boots with the buckles I, I'll link those down below um, these sheer these sheer text red tights I'll try to link those too down below if you're interested in these um, I don't even know if I think they were just about sold out when I purchased them and like I said it took forever to get them um, what else did I show you guys that may be still available? I don't know, but just check the description box um, if, um, if, if you know, if there's anything that I showed you that is still available, um, I will link it down below. So, um, but I that took a lot out of me. That took about two hours to film because as as I was you know recording, I also was taking photos too um, for a thumbnail and also to share on on um instagram so um but yeah i'm trying to think if there are any other like outfits videos that um i'm gonna do for you guys before christmas so if you guys have any suggestions of like any kind of outfit i'm looking at my phone that's why i'm looking down y'all sorry not to be rude or anything but i was looking at my phone um trying to look at the uh calendar and see like videos that I have planned and just like what um, other outfit videos that I can do styling videos that I can do if you guys have any suggestions let me know um, I'm definitely gonna do like the um, more glammed dressed up uh, holiday Christmas looks that will also include like New Year's Eve looks too so um, I'm trying to think is there any other um, I haven't been doing like my Pinterest inspired videos just because this whole month has really just been vlogmas but if you guys want to see that during vlogmas let me know um where i like recreate outfits um based on what i find on pinterest um let me know so cause i'm trying to do more I'm trying to make these videos more like christmasy vibes or in the at the very least more like winter vibes you know for the season so uh, but i guess i could do pinterest outfits you know winter edition or something i don't know girl but y'all let me know if you have any other uh like styling out you know outfit ideas that um you guys want to see during vlogmas so um because i know a lot of you guys are here for the fashion and i want to give you what you want but i also want to do you know do other things too like vlogmas um where you just kind of go around with me during the day um but yeah so i don't think i have anything else planned for the rest of this day uh, my son has a basketball game later on, so I'm definitely going to go to that later on. Um, but other than that, I don't think I have anything else planned. I need to go get something to eat because I have not, I have yet to eat. I've been, I started recording kind of late, so just because I just was tired. So um, I need to go and get something to eat. So I'll probably go do that. Um, so I'm just going to end the vlog here because I already know it's going to be long because I'm long-winded. And I just had fun styling up these outfits. So um, check out the the video where I actually showed you guys the uh, the the thrifted pieces. In case you want to see them up close, I mean I don't know why you would want to, but I mean you saw them up close, I guess, with me trying them on. But if you want like an in depth, because I didn't go over like the pricing or anything or sizing or the brands, you know, because I'm not really that, you know, hip to like what brands to look for when I go to the thrift store. Obviously. Well, I shouldn't say that. Um, there are certain brands that I do look for, like Ralph Lauren, because I'm a huge Ralph Lauren fan. Um, Polo Ralph Lauren, or, or Ralph Lauren. How, I don't know how. I think people in the UK pronounce it Ralph Lauren. Um, but I do look for that brand, because I know that's going to be good quality. Um, I just look for certain brands, but a lot of these older brands, and I know a lot of these ladies who you know love to thrift know like a lot of these older brands. Like I think St. John's Bay is a brand that i know a lot of thrift ladies look for and when i say thrift ladies i mean ladies whose whose uh channel is all about thrifting so they know the brands to look out for you know i'm not i'm not gonna even pretend like i know all the brands the good brands like the older brands to look out for but for me the brand that I, my go-to brand that i look for is definitely ralph lauren um but 
yeah I'm, i feel like if it's at the thrift store for the most part it, unless it's like brand new coming from the store i feel like it's good quality anyway because most thrift, thrift stores will put good quality although i don't know sometimes they throw a little fast fashion in there too but because i've gotten some stuff from fast fashion brands as well so from the thrift store but you know if you want like good quality brands um just look for those good quality brands <laughs> i guess is what i'm you know the, i don't know any other way to say it um but yeah i want to go to another there's a thrift store that i went to last block and said i want to go to it's like further away from where i live or it's out of you know out of town or whatever out of town it's further away from where i live so i don't know if i want to do it for vlogmas or just wait so um but we'll see um all right guys so i am going to guess i guess i'll end the vlog here because like i said it's already super long with the outfits and whatnot and i don't have anything else planned so i think i'm just going to end it here so the next vlog you see or the next video you'll see will probably be the um more dressed up looks for christmas more dressed up vibes although this video could kind of double as that too but the next one is going to be lots of sequins <laughs> lots of metallic um just so you're warned it's going to be a lot of a lot of sequins and metallics and just dressy looks is going to be the next video because i've already done one with casual christmas outfits so the next one is going to be more um dressier like i said with sequins and you know all the embellishments and all the things so stay tuned for the next video that you guys will see but yeah thank you guys so much for watching um like i said let me know down in the comments which outfit was your favorite and if you want to see a makeup tutorial on this look it's looking beat up now because i've been changing clothes but yeah if you guys want to see this little makeup tutorial i think it'll be cute for the uh, season holiday season as well so all right so i will see you guys in the next video don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss a thing so yeah see you guys in the next one all right bye guys